there was the three biggest ones. Oh, the dark triad. The dark so triad. So it's yeah. um, psychopathy, narcissism, yeah, Machiavellianism. Awesome. Sometimes psychopathy comes out as attractive, depending on your study methodology. Machiavellianism, uh, not really. Mm -hmm. That that doesn't. It might, so to, to define them briefly, narcissism is, and uh, this isn't my area, mm -hmm. but narcissism. It's like the stereotype. It's this self-obsession, this excessive mm -hmm. self-interest, delusions of grandeur, right? Delusional confidence, these sorts of things. And it's on a spectrum. So you can be more or less narcissistic. You can have clinical narcissism. You have Machiavellianism, which is this capacity to be manipulative and deceitful and scheming to get ahead. And then you have psychopathy, which is callousness, ruthlessness, right? Mm -hmm. Emotional deadness. When you do studies on the dark triad, which often come together together, Sometimes they do come out as uh, attractive, at least in some contexts, mm -hmm. right? I'm not, I'm not saying that there's no truth to the bad boy thing, but there have been some studies that indicate that it's narcissism that's driving the effect, okay. right? So Machiavellianism, not really. Yep. Psychopathy, maybe, right? Like psycho psychopaths have a higher number of sexual partners, mm -hmm. but th so do psychopathic women. I, I mean, it, it could just be that, you know, it could just be that that type of person isn't interested mm -hmm. in a lovely, loving, long-term relationship. Yeah, true, and so they yeah, end up having you. a lot of flings. But narcissism does seem to drive some attractiveness effect. And the question is why? Well, this is, again, speculation. But part of it could be that narcissists invest more in their physical attractiveness, right? They certainly seem to. And just investing more might make you more physically attractive. And that might come out in something like a speed dating study. Could also be that narcissists come off as very confident, and confidence is controlling for you know signs of insecurity and low self-esteem, which are unattractive. So that could be part of why it's attractive. Mm -hmm. It could also be that narcissism just is attractive itself, right? Yeah, it could yeah. be that we're trying to find the sub-factors here. It could be that that is a sexy trait. It's a dangerous trait to be attractive to because narcissists have higher rates of infidelity, mm. right? They tend to not have super successful interpersonal relationships. It's, it's obviously not a great thing to be, to be a narcissist. But there's these suite of traits, the dark triad, that as a whole might have some impact on attractiveness in some contexts. Mm. I'm thinking specifically in short-term contexts and certainly are attractive to some women, right? Mm. Some yeah, well, women yeah, are, you have to say that. Yeah, yeah, specific women are going to find this attractive. But as a general class of traits, they don't necessarily seem to help except narcissism.